Growing up, I had an ambivalent relationship with music. Everything was about grades and being right. I wasn't right a lot of the time, and it made me scared of playing at all. As an adult, it was hard to find a place for music. I wanted to play again, but I didn't know how. I tried out a lot of things, but nothing seemed to fit. I was confused. If I wanted to perform, why was I so scared of the stage? If I didn't want to perform, why did I think about it all the time? Three years ago, in a series of unplanned and undoubtedly hilarious happenings that we don't have time to go into right now, I moved to a city where I didn't know anyone to play songs that had started to stick in the back of my head like a scratched record. The result was pretty good. It turns out that coming as you are and giving it your best shot is a pretty successful recipe for making stuff. Since throwing caution to the wind and thinking, well, what's the worst that could happen? I've played all over the shop with all kinds of musicians and different types of creatives. I've played in synth bands and folk bands and post-industrial improvisation outfits. I've played with jazz musicians and pop musicians, developed shows with spoken word artists and made music videos with brilliant filmmakers. In general, I've got to create a lot of stuff with other people that I never could have made on my own. Because my father used to say like music is an international language. So where I'm at now feels pretty good. I've just finished recording my first solo album, which is a love letter to everything that brought me here, including the classical stuff that used to hold me back. Playing with other people has been the single most important thing in changing how I think about music. It's something I was never able to do before, and it's the one thing that now keeps me constantly moving forwards. In a roundabout way, I found a way to play music again and to create rather than just regurgitate the things that I was taught. But now I'm wondering, what's next? Maybe it's because I spent so long being scared of playing with other people, but now I'm on a mission to create as much different stuff with as many different people as possible. And if that involves showing up without a plan in a place where you don't know anyone, so much the better.